Hi, Nicole Bass here. Down here to play Holly Weird Squares. And uh, $2,500 up for grabs. It's mine. What are you playing against today? Today I'm playing against Joey Butt, uh, what is he? A hole? A Fuko? A head? I don't know. But he is a definite loser. Joey Butt a loser! So, um, $2,500 still mine. Hey, it's Joey Buttafuoco, and I'm here in New York, all the way from L.A., doing Howard Stern's show. Not doing Howard, but <laughs> doing Howard. He's playing a little Hollywood squares and putting Man Lady up there, Nicole. Gonna have some fun with that. I hope she doesn't have so much anger. I guess that's what happens when a man cuts his penis off, gets that attitude, you know? Poor guy. Any bad blood between you two still? Uh, you know what? I, you know what? There's no bad blood in me for anybody, but if she's going to keep it going, I'll keep it going. If she yeah. wants to fight, I'd love to fight her. You would actually do that? I'd actually fight her, yeah. You'd have no problem? I'd have that. no problem fighting her. Him, her, whatever. Whatever it is, I would have no problem kicking its butt. Here's the deal. We're going to make you up as Kelly Clarkson today, so I need you uh, to cooperate with me as I get you dressed, okay? I always cooperate. All right. We're going to close the door. I'm going to get you ready. And we need five minutes to do it real quick, all right? Yeah. Did you shower today? Yeah, I did. You did? Yeah. You sure? Absolutely. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right, take off your hat. Take off your shirt, and I hate saying that in front of you, with me standing in front of you as well. Okay. You know what we're doing, right? Yeah. You're Kelly Clark, so okay. we're going to make it like a, little, a pretty little schoolgirl today. Okay. For the Holly Weird Square. Yeah, I don't mind. All right. Have you ever had makeup? You wore makeup before. I did? Yeah. Who are you? Not high pitch Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> What's up, Fred? What are you doing here tonight? Follow well, him. Hi. You're going up those what steps. What are you doing here tonight? Up the steps. I do squares. All right. I do squares. If I know how it, I will probably be in one of those on puppet squares. He will never give me the center or the corner square. It'll be someday, isn't it? What's up, Kyle? I'm going up front. What's up, man? How are you today, man? Good, good. Good. Bring you down. Well, I'm here to play Holly Weird Squares, you know? Yeah. And Gary Delabate actually had the balls. He tells me the lineup. And he goes, well, you'll really be the A-list celebrity out of everybody. And I was like, oh, really? Out of that crew? Thanks, Gary. Jeez, well, then I'm definitely doing it. How does that make you feel? Oh, I'm stupid. It makes me feel like Gary must think I'm dumb, that I think that that's a uh, privilege, that that's an honor among the crew we're with. Well, we're going in this room here. What do you think you're uh, a company with? Wow. Hey! I didn't know Eric was here. Getting ready. Ask him if he wants yeah. breakfast. Putting on his pretty white robe. How long does it take you to get into your uh, your full robe? About a minute. A minute. That's it. That's it. Quick preparation. It's like putting on a coat. Good morning, Wendy. Follow. How are you today? Fine. Good. We're gonna go upstairs, okay? Okay. We're gonna go right up here. Here's your seat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The biggest pain in the ass that ever walked through the door of this show is coming in now. Jeff the drunk. Right. Can't stomach the motherfucker. Bringing him in. Let's go. Yeah. Well, Joe's up there. Okay. I don't like it. Joe kick his ass if you have to. I don't like it too hard. Go ahead. I don't like go. it too hard. Come on, go. Jeff. Let's go. We're going yeah, right up the stairs, okay, okay. buddy. Okay, okay. All right. Let's no go, worries. buddy. Good. How you upstairs. doing? Upstairs. Upstairs. Yeah, we're going right. upstairs. Why do they always put me up freaking yeah, stairs? Yeah, you don't need to shave yourself wearing that jacket. Uh, Dale and Mark Jr. Fuck you, bitch. I don't like it too hard. Fuck you, buddy. Jeff, going right in here. Yeah, no, I gotta go piss now. There's no bathroom up here. Yeah, there is. Hold on. Joe, you know where the bathroom is for this guy up here? I don't know where it's at. Yeah, I think you have one here. No, no. This way, come on. Yeah. Jeff, come on. Where? All right. Why didn't you tell me that first when you were downstairs? Because. I'm gonna need some extra. I'm a douchebag. It's the Holly Weird Squares on the Howard Stern Show, featuring Kelly Clarkson, rapper Trick Daddy, the Spit Girls, comedian Colin Quinn, Wendy the Retard, Jeff the Drunk. Elephant Boy, 
Melrose Larry Green. And in the center square, it's Daniel Carver from the KKK. Now it's time to play Hollywood Squares. Now, here's your host, Howard Stern. Hi, we're on the set of Holly Weird Squares. Our two contestants are Joey Buttafuoco. You're going to stop the fight. Oh, jeez. Gary's going to stop the fight. Well, me, me and these two big guys behind me. <laughs> okay. I'm here, Can, to, I'm here to coach I you. I don't want you two fighting physically. Yeah, this is supposed to. We're just going to play Holly Weird Squares. Howard, you know, she, she makes a point, though. I mean, if they start punching, what am I going to do? I don't know. You're I dead meat, know. Gary. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> But you're a brave man for sitting there. <laughs> Joey Buttafuoco and, and of course, uh, the lovely Nicole Bass, the Ooh. world's largest bodybuilder, female. Is she still, um, do you still have that uh, designation? Still have that designation. Still in the Guinness Book of World Records. Okay. Freak. Ugh. Yeah, look who's talking. Oh, I'm a guy wearing guy clothes. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah, you're a yeah. guy. Your penis may be bigger than mine, but hey, I'm a guy. You're in jail. What? And they let you out of jail? I just got out, man. I know. Thank. Oh you know, man, I just shut up. All right. Why should I shut up? Why should I shut up? I feel they could, will make they you could, shut up. They couldn't like give you a haircut in jail. No, they couldn't, I couldn't give you a haircut. Couldn't get a haircut. Can't afford a haircut. No, I could. It was two bucks. Yeah. Can't afford a haircut. I can afford it. You can't Jail afford it. Look at, by the way. Look at you. LA Craig, County. What are you, like Rodney Dangerfield? All right. H? Obviously, the Hollywood hey, squares. That's Rodney. How are about we Rodney? play a game with What him? are you, like 70 now? I'm <laughs> feeling like it. Let me tell you, five and a half months in LA, LA County was kind of rough, man. Da uh, let me ask you guys something. Hollywood Squares is the best place to work out your feud. Whoever wins not only gets $2,500 prize, which I'm sure everyone could use, Stop but staring at me. Why? Because you're so goddamn ugly. If anybody could Look see this. Look who's talking. Jesus. Look who's talking. You and your little pinky ring jewelry. Got that for my son. You're... What do you think you are? Like the godmother? A pinky <laughs> ring like that is yeah. the godmother? You're the godmother. Oh, Jesus. All right. Joey, why were Stupid you... Stupid ass. Joey, why were you in jail? I got in trouble in L.A., but it's all done and finished. <laughs> so he's in trouble. Why did you do five months you in jail? You know what it was? It was a bogus insurance uh, fraud claim against yeah, me. Yeah, bogus. It really was. It really was. <laughs> yeah, it, it really right. was. Did they have you, you on tape? fake car yeah. part. In your, yeah, and I have the CD. If you, if you actually heard the CD, you, would, you couldn't believe that, that I went to jail for something like that. But. So they had you on tape. Oh, and on the jury only. And the jury convicted you based on the tape. No, no, no. Insurance I just played it out. fraud, it's called. Yeah, I played hey, it Joey's out. Joey's like glossing it over. It's insurance fraud. You can't put old parts in a car and then charge somebody, like, for the new parts price. <laughs> Is that what happened? Yeah. No, that's not what happened. <laughs> what, what do you it think really, happened? It really, really wasn't look, what look, happened. Look, look, look. What happened? Lost for what words. do we hear I'm really not at a lost for words. <laughs> I'm really not. <laughs> Honestly, and I have the CD, and I got it from well, the Well, what DA. would you hear on the CD? Yeah. You would hear a, a, an undercover cop come in wanting to get a full paint job on his car. And I told him, I said, you know, and he wanted to scratch the rest of the car by himself and do it. And I said, don't do it. It's insurance fraud. <laughs> he did it anyway. He brings it in the next couple of days. I settled the claim. I went to jail because I had knowledge that he did a fraudulent claim. Nicole, do you buy that? I don't buy that for That's one true. second. It's true. Right. Just have like, knowledge. I'm like, I can't Mr. catch Joey a break. Mr. Joey bought a few go. Honest, honest, Your Honor. I have a CD that says that <laughs> I was. No, it was a DA. It was a district attorney <laughs> CD. CD. It was great. I heard that I what is heard When are we going to put it out on, on, like, you know, will it be out in Tower Records or something where <laughs> we can pick up this CD and to you buy the, it? You're an idiot. <laughs> were, were you in the. Do you sing in it? I mean. <laughs> You're an idiot. You're such a I heart. heard, Joe. I'm that an idiot. He goes to jail, and I'm an idiot. I heard that you're <laughs> explaining to the person how to. <laughs> no, it wasn't like that at okay. all. It really wasn't. Right. Do you have a copy of the CD? I do. Do you have it here? I think we might have it. Yeah, can we play it? Well, maybe we will, but we do have to play the Hollywood Squares. <laughs> right, I think right. everyone's waiting for that. Really, I really have it. It's for sure. But, you know, it's easy just to plead it out, go to jail for 40 days. and Well, at least no. <laughs> no. He wanted to be in jail with all those other guys. <laughs> <laughs> Bend over, Joey. What an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Was it, did anybody try to have sex Joey, with you in jail? Uh, no. 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 Did no you one. try to have sex with anybody? <laughs> <laughs> no. Did you get into any fist fights in jail? <laughs> no. Well, it could have it jumped, but we were in lockdown. I mean, 
I was in with, with <laughs> Mayor nice Bradley. Tan. Thank right. you. I was in with Mayor Did Bradley. You, like, says spend hi. all the time Listen, in your yard. And like, Kenny Kimes, who was who the, the New York kid. Who oh, you met Kenny mom. Kimes? He was my he was my cellmate. Wow. For five and, a half and what did he, what was his crime? He him and his mom used to kill allegedly people. killed some, some people. <laughs> allegedly used to. Everything's allegedly when you're in the joint. Did he say that he didn't do it? Did he say he was innocent? No, no. No, he's turned state's evidence against his mother. Oh. Yeah, but he, he's a brilliant man. Oh, he's smart. <laughs> no, he has a sharp cat. But. Good roommate? Cellmate, yeah, he was fine. Yeah. He cooked all the time. It was good. Yeah, it was all good. So you weren't nervous in jail. You kind no. of made yourself home. I mean, Where do you cook in jail? Right. Yeah, Joey's got a bit of a pot belly going over here. You, co- you cooked it over the sink? Well, you can cook in the warm water that they provide through the sink. Well, what would you make? Well, I'm shocked. Anything you can buy off the store list, like ramen noodles or crap like that, because you can't eat the food that they give you because it's Horrible. slop. It's bad. It's bad stuff. All right. So you're, you're now you, you're out of jail. This is a good thing for you're you. You're turning over a new leaf. Again. <laughs> another <laughs> leaf. Another side. You're turning over leaf. another new leaf. Yeah, not just the same. It's just, yeah, my wife so is So who's the place. guy that you're engaged to? <laughs> She's such a retard. <laughs> I'm a retard. You really you are, spend Nicole. You're five and a half you months know, so in jail. You get a little closer. And I'm, I'm in jail. Why are you two? Jail. Why are you two at such odds? I even forget. Yeah, I have you and no idea. Nicole. I because have no idea. this guy, this guy here has. I mean, Howard. It's funny when you make fun of me. It really is. It's hilarious. It's hilarious to hear Fred. It's like Robin. You know, it, it, you guys really made me I who I am. Is it tip of your nose? Can get like any browner? You are such I an ass kiss. And honestly, I owe a lot to you. Thank this you. guy here, who who is he? What is he famous for? I never come okay. in here and blow up why, the show. Why why does he have the right to make fun of me? Who is he to make fun of me? Right. Who is he? It's not fair, okay. it's not fair, 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 Girl, um, uh, all right, Johnny. It was stupid. All right, so okay? why don't we have you two settle this She's right now? Pissed because she couldn't get the fun. Let me introduce the squares to you. Yeah, Hollywood I'm, squares. I'd still fight you. You can kiss my ass. I'd still fight you. I wouldn't kiss your ass if you. You're kissing it right now. And let's oh. meet our squares. <laughs> all right. You want to go ahead and hold a fight? I'll fight you right now, all. I'll Let, fight you right in here. I'll kick you in the nuts. <laughs> this isn't working out like the regular Hollywood squares. The, yeah. the I've never seen the contestants go at each other like this. We're paying for $2,500. $2,500 goes to the winner of our game. What you now, got Joey, it? What size bra are you up to? Look at those boobs. I don't have any boobs. Yes, you do. No, 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 no. no. That's fat. No. You are major out of shape. Yeah, I am. I'm out of shape. Satin so are you, you sack of crap. <laughs> I Look train. at you. I saw I, you standing in there. Oh, you're missing. Actually, you're not, really, not hey, You know something? Let's play the game, Howard. All right, let's play the yeah. game. Joey Bonifuco yeah. says, let's play the game. Nicole yeah, Bass, play. are you ready to play? I'm ready to play. Are you ready to kick his ass in the ready game Hollywood Squares? I'm she can't kick, kick anybody's ass, ass Howard. Still you kick believe his this? Ass. Look at what I have. First thing this morning, that's one of the first things I saw. It's, but I want to throw Let's up. go to the squares. Yeah. Come on. Here I we go. look at you through glass. Ladies and gentlemen, in our glass, first square in the right upper through. left-hand corner is Kelly Clarkson. Let's say hi to Kelly. Hi, Kelly Clarkson. Hi, Howard. Hi, Kelly. How are you? All right, wow. Kelly Clarkson, you uh, are from American Idol. You were the winner of the first season, and now your singing career and your touring career is going great, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes. What's your, your uh, hit song, Kelly? I forget. A moment like this. <laughs> Kelly, you're wearing a pretty red dress and lipstick and beautiful brown hair. You look great. Thank you, Howard. All right, let's go to Trick Daddy, who's joining us today. Trick Daddy's new album is out in stores right now. Trick Daddy, welcome to the squares. What's up now? How's the album <laughs> selling? Uh, we're doing good. Yeah, I love that song of yours. I do, that, that, that new hit song that you have. <laughs> hey, I appreciate it. I got many more for you coming up soon. Trick Daddy, you're sitting next to the very famous Kelly Clarkson. How's that feel? Oh, she's sexy. Right. <laughs> Thank you, Trick Daddy. Trick Daddy's album is in stores right now. you got to go pick it up. It's called Married to the Streets, featuring the single Let's Go. It's available in stores. And now, meet the Spit Whores. Oh, God. The two girls making out right next to Trick Daddy in the upper right-hand square. Hi, girls. How are you? Hey, Howard. Girls, when a guy spits on you, do you really get sexual fulfillment out of that, or is it just for the uh, camera? 
Well, you know, it's kind of like you're in your own world there. And, uh, yeah, I mean, you, you really do. It's it's kind of a degrading in a very sexual, fun way. How did you get into this line of work? I mean, getting spit on. Did you know you like being spit on? Yeah. I didn't. I mean, I, it was something you kind of have to go with. Like, if someone was walking down the street and they spit on me, I'd fucking... Oh. 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 <laughs> I, I would deck them. But, like, if you're going at it and it's really passionate and it's really hot and someone spits in your face or your mouth, it's part of the moment. You just, oh. you just roll with it. And in addition okay. to being spit on, you've acted like a dog in one of your films, right? I oh. did. I just finished a movie called Cock Hounds, and um, that's the title of the film. Right. And, um, right. And uh, I was a dog in it. Now do your dog. This is my dog. Dog collar, actually, from the movie. Wow. Can you do a little bit of the dog? Woof, woof. I was a um, <laughs> German <laughs> Shepherd, actually. Far for me. Trick yeah. Daddy, you uh, ever see these girls' films, or you don't watch that stuff? No, but I'm sure they're going to give me a couple copies so I can go home and get acquainted with myself. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Cammy, when you were 15, you started dating a 37-year-old guy. So you've always been a bit of a troublemaker, right? Um, I've always been a dirty sex pig. And you say you had sex with one of your high school teachers after uh, you, you left high school, right? I did. Why is that? You just wanted to prove that you could get him? No, it's just, you know, I've always had a thing for authority figures. I've always <coughs> messed around with my bosses or whoever's in charge. And Nikki, you once puked out a car window while having an orgasm. Isn't that true? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that wow. must have been hot. <laughs> it was actually, it was, a, it was a date, and um, I drank a lot, and we were messing around, and um, I was orgasming, but I also had to throw up. So I'm like, hey, I'm going to stick my head out the back window, and I, I told um, the guy to keep on going. <laughs> All right, girls. Well, it's fun having you here on the squares. It's going to be a big match. And by the way, check out Cammie Andrews and CammieAndrews.com, uh, Nikki Hunter at NikkiHunter.com, and check out both girls at MeatHoles.com. <laughs> MeatHoles.com. <laughs> Okay. Let's say hi to Colin Quinn. Colin, who, of course, is at ColinQuinn.com. Colin, how are you? I'm doing great, Howard. Colin, Thanks. you are a noted comedian. You have your own show on Comedy Central. You are, well, uh, not for long, this week. Uh, I heard it got canceled. This is the end? Yeah, this is the last week. You might want to talk to the spit whores about getting into their line of work. I was going to say, what is Colin doing on his website? We I would like to, uh, yeah, maybe I can do something with them on MeatHoles.com. <laughs> <laughs> well, Colin, we're uh, honored to have you here with us, and you're sitting Thank right you. underneath Kelly Clarkson. If you stood up, you would pile drive him. <laughs> Hi, Hi Colin. Hi, oh, Kelly. look who's flirting with Colin. Colin Quinn, it's <laughs> Kelly Clarkson. I know, Colin. Kelly, I've always had a big crush on you. Hey, wait a second. You kind of sound and look like high pitch. Who's high pitch? <laughs> this is Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> In our center square is Daniel Carver from the Ku Klux Always Klan. the center square. <laughs> Daniel, who are you voting for in the election? I know you don't like black people. You don't like Jews. You don't like Puerto Ricans. You're with the Ku Klux Klan. You don't like Mexicans. Who is the candidate that you're voting for? We're going to vote for George Bush. I had a feeling. <laughs> now, why is that? Do you have any feelings uh, about... Uh, him and Kerry both are, are about the same on uh, letting them Mexicans come into the country. But uh, Bush, he's he's more moral. He's against uh, abortions. He's against uh, homosexuals. Uh, he just he believes in God, the same God we believe in. I don't know what Kerry believes in. Now, I notice you're wearing your Ku Klux Klan hood, and you're sitting under Trick Daddy, and your hood is almost going right, right up, up Trick Daddy. Yeah. <laughs> Trick Daddy, you must hate this guy. I mean, uh, I'm about to kick him in the top of his head. Oh, you ain't gonna kick nothing, nigger. <laughs> oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, 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 All right, Cracker, watch your mouth. <laughs> Trick Daddy will kick your ass, Daniel Carter. Oh, you Trick Daddy won't do nothing. <laughs> your, mama, your mama should have swallowed you, boy. <laughs> oh, shut up. <clears throat> he's just an example of what the world's coming to. <laughs> Trick Daddy's an artist. He, uh, has he ain't an artist, he's a dumb nigger. <laughs> I wish you was my master. I would have poisoned you a long time ago. <laughs> Trick Daddy, you never, if you had lived, <laughs> Trick Daddy, if you had lived in the deep south during the plantation days, you would have turned on your master in two seconds. I would have had sex with his mama. You'd have had a lot of brown sisters and brothers. <laughs> You hear that, Daniel? He'd have been out there in the barn tied up with a mule like the nigger he is. <laughs> well, I got news for you. You don't know Trick Daddy then. Well, this is going to no, be an I interesting... I don't know him. I don't want to know him. That's what's wrong with the country today. Too many white people knowing niggers. We don't need to know them. It's Stay away many, from them. Avoid them at it's all too many, Hey, It's too many rednecks having sex with their daughters. There ain't enough rednecks. There ain't right. enough rednecks. 
Well, Daniel, we had more rednecks. We'd clean up this country and get rid of these niggers. The country's getting darker and darker. Crime continues to rise. Our taxes are going higher and higher. Because you don't beige, boy. You got the beige. No, it ain't because of me. It's because of the white people are trying to uh, cater to the niggers to get their votes. It's a politically correct thing to do. We need to quit being politically correct. Stand up for our, our God. He separated us from y'all. He separated this uh, white people from niggers over and over again. God but he said he wouldn't do, do it again. This. He said if we let you remain among us, you would become as thorns in our, our side and pricks in our eye. And that's right. You if are. God had anything to do with this, you would have never made it. Right. Yeah. Hey, by the way, guys, Colin Quinn's trying to get a word in edgewise. He wants to use the N-word. <laughs> All right. Everybody yeah. uses the N-word when they can. All right, well, Daniel. Well, that stop Nicole and Joey Hello, from Colin. fighting. Hello, uh, Colin. Hi, Kelly. <laughs> I, All did, right. I just wanted to say it was great seeing you last night, and I gave you aura last night. All right. Let's say hi to Wendy the Retard, who sits right next to Daniel Carver. Hi, Howard. Great seeing you, Wendy. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Howard. Wendy, I need you to use all your IQ points and make sure you answer the questions properly, because a lot is riding on this $2,500. Okay. All right, Wendy. And, Wendy, you are sitting next to Daniel Carver. Have you ever met him before? Uh, we were just talking in the room. Isn't it true Daniel raped you once? Yes. And isn't it true you had his baby? <laughs> yes. And isn't it true you live with him full time? Yes. And isn't he t didn't he turn you into a filthy little dirty whore? Yes. Daniel, do you deny these charges? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't. You deny him. All right. That's it took good. a little while, though. All right, Wendy. No, it didn't take long at all. You ain't You're asking the same me. question. She raped Bush. She raped Clinton. Uh, Wendy, did you rape Howard? No. Right. Did Howard rape you? Yes. Oh. Okay. All right. Wendy. <laughs> hey, Wendy, didn't Daniel secretly tell you he likes black people? Yes, he did. And didn't he secretly tell you that he actually really loves black people and wants to marry a black woman? Yes. And he, he wants to have fantasizes about Halle Berry. And he wants to have black children. Yes. There you go. That's what I thought. All right, Wendy. Thank you, Wendy. <laughs> I I agree, Howard. George W. Bush needs to pack his things out and leave. John Kerry needs to win. <laughs> and there is the retard vote. The retard vote is going to Kerry. Typical Kerry voter. Typical Kerry <laughs> voter. All right, let's get down to Jeff the Drunk in the lower left-hand corner right underneath Colin Quinn, Jeff the Drunk Caro. What's up, bitch? How are you, Jeff? <laughs> How are you? Uh-oh, Wendy's taking clothes off. What? <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, and you I just... I that's the extent of it. And you've recently moved into a new trailer home, right? Not yet. Let's talk to Elephant Boy right next to Jeff the Drunk. Elephant Boy, good to see you. It's great to be here. <laughs> Elephant Boy, you know to answer the question so we can move the game along, right? Yes. All right. And Elephant Melrose. Elephant Boy's dressed in an American flag. Why are you wearing an American flag? Uh, it was a. I just. For for election day. Okay. What did he say? For, for election, election day. day. Oh, election, election day. day. I thought he had an erection day. I don't know about. <laughs> Hello, Elephant Boy. It's Kelly Clarkson. No, I'm Kelly Clarkson. I'm a real Kelly Clarkson. No, you're just high pitch. No, who's high pitch? This is Kelly Clarkson. And let's say hi to Melrose Larry Green. I've let him back on the show after a two-year ban. Shocked. How are you, Melrose? Good morning, Howard. Good morning, Robin. Let's hi hope there. you let's hope you do well because if you don't, you have another two-year ban. <laughs> oh, it's great to be back. It's great to be back. All right. Let's uh, get down to the game now. Everybody is familiar with Nicole Bass, the world's largest female bodybuilder, and Joey Buttafuoco, fresh out of prison, famous for the Amy uh, Fisher uh, thing. She's and back in the news because she's written a book. That's yeah, right. more cycle babble. <laughs> you know, that's another case you got framed in, didn't you? Absolutely. Yeah, you know where right. else he got framed? Uh, with the prostitute in L.A. He had gotten framed with that one, too, remember? Framed. Always. Framed. Always. always. Well, let's get down to the framed. game. Ladies first, so Joey, you go first. <laughs> You're an ass? What? <laughs> he knows what he is. <laughs> what was that, Gary? I'm a jerk. I know. All right. Look, I, I want to say ladies first. Nicole, you should go first. Or I is it jo or first. Jody, Joey more the lady? No, I'm more the lady. Men first. Men first? <laughs> I'll go first. Go ahead. <laughs> All right, Nicole. It's X's and O's. It's a game of tic-tac-toe. Pick Kelly Clarkson, Trick Daddy, Spit Girls, Colin Quinn, Daniel Carver, Wendy the Retard, Melrose Larry, Elephant Boy, or Jeff the Drunk. I think we should get Daniel Carver out of the way. All right, center square, Daniel Carver. <laughs> it's waving. <laughs> okay. Loves to play a game. Daniel, <laughs> according to National Vanguard, do white people kill more black people than blacks kill white people? Do white people kill more black people than blacks kill white people? No, black, black people kill more white people. 
Daniel says black people kill more white people. Agree or disagree? Agree or disagree? I'll agree. Blacks murder whites 18 times the rate whites murder blacks. You're absolutely right. <laughs> Yay. All right, so what is All she right. an X or Smarter not? than you, Joey Butthead. She's an X. So X gets the square. All right. Well, Joey, it's a game of strategy. What do you mean you're smarter than me, Butthead? I haven't even gone yet, Knucklehead. <laughs> you retard. I think you belong in Wendy's spot, Nicole. Oh, oh poor Wendy. Well, she's going to get an ass kicking before the day's over, I'm telling you right now. Who, oh, Wendy? No, this oh. retard over here. No, this retard over here. I don't want any fisty cuffs. Why not? Settle this. Have I'll so do it real fast. Just the backhand to the face, put it right down. Settle. Yeah, right? Cheat. I'll get right or Cheat. What's the cheat about that? <laughs> yeah, get in the way. You'll get it, too. I know. Because <laughs> I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready to go. Let's right settle now. this. Good, you right now. Let's settle I'm this with the squares. Come on. <laughs> okay. Joey looks all <clears throat> hot under the collar. Don't get hot under the collar, Lurch. I don't. I'm cool. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. All right, let's settle it with the square. square. Settle it uh, with the square. I'd like to go with Colin Quinn, all time favorite. All right, Colin Quinn is your That's favorite. That's Joe. <laughs> Colin, did you know you were Joey Buttafuoco's favorite? I didn't, but I'm flattered. Here we go. Don't be a wise Colin guy. Quinn, ColinQuinn.com. I'm not being a wise guy, Joey. Don't be a wise guy. Look at Joey wants to start with me now. I'll come in there. <laughs> Damn it, Joey. I'll come in there. I'll tie you up and choke you. <laughs> go ahead and laugh. Funny and you're, guy. And you're, you're his favorite. Guy. Wow. Let Colin, me answer the question for you. Colin, you've had gay experiences. Dan, Daniel, you don't like the gays, do you? Daniel, you don't like the gay people, do you? No, I don't like faggots. Well, <laughs> did you know that Colin, who's sitting next to you, had a gay experience? No, I don't know him at all. Hey, they were having <laughs> words a little before the show. What were they talking about? Joey like had gay experiences, too. Talking about Robin sitting up on the corner giggling about everything. Oh. All right. Let's that's, that's your talent. Thank you, Dan. <laughs> I kick his ass. Don't pick on my friend Robin. I kick his ass for free. I'd kick his ass too for free. Yeah, you. They're they're all joined forces with you. you This is Kelly Clarkson. (laughs) All right. Can we all just can we all just act like adults here? All right, Colin, you've had some gay experiences. Here it goes. All right. Which Teletubby did Jerry Fowell think was gay? (laughs) Do I have to name the name of it, or can I just say the color? Oh, you could name the color. Because I don't know the name of the Teletubbies. Uh, sure you don't. Yeah, pretend you don't. <laughs> like you don't know the gay Teletubbies. I'll say the pink one. The pink one. <laughs> what do you think, Joey? Was Agreed it the pink one? Or yeah, I'm going to guess, but I'll disagree. You're, you're, you're lucky you disagreed. He was purple. Lavender. So, oh, okay. Tinky Winky. Tinky Winky. Was it Tinky Winky? You're not supposed to yell the answers out from the corner. Hey, it was after it was talking. done. No, it wasn't. It was before it was done. If we replayed the CD to that, we definitely <laughs> oh, would have... Go ahead, Bob and Louie. I'm not joking around or anything. I'm going to step out of here <laughs> and what? let Joe sit down because I'm not comfortable being here anymore. But really, what yeah. happened? I don't know. Just uh, Joey's making... He's weirding me out. So I don't, Joey I, just called you a fan. I don't want to take a punch to the face for Nicole. I would never do that to you, Gary. No, I no, like you. I'm saying if you go to hit her... I don't like her. I'm you like better hit not me. hit her, I'm Joey. I'm not going to hit you. I swear to no, God. No, but you, might, you don't want to do it on purpose. Purpose. Well, it might happen by accident. Exactly. But I don't no, think Joey, we're finish. not having we're yeah, not having that. The fight's not I'm today. Just, I don't know, I'm just gonna. I'm seriously. No, no, it's okay. I'm not gonna do nothing. I swear to God. <laughs> All right, Joey's cool. Joey, right. Joey, just, just sit and be, behave All yourself. Right. Okay. Daniel, you, don't you love how the white people get along? Prove to your parole officer you're under control. All right, here we go. Yeah. Are you on any kind of probation? No, there's nothing. Not, there's nothing. There's no probation. Paid a fine. You paid a fine. No, okay. Rest retribution. It's nothing. All right, it's only half a year in jail. Come on, go ahead, Nicole. Five hundred grand. Hey, no problem. No big deal. Oh boy. Go ahead, Nicole. Okay. Okay, I choose Kelly Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson! Hi, Nicole, you look great. It's okay, high pitch. So I mean, I, Kelly Clarkson. high pitch? <laughs> this is Kelly Clarkson. Who American Idol, the TV show American Idol first originated in the United Kingdom under the name Rock and Roll Idol. True or false? Uh, I would have to say false. Agree Nicole? Disagree. I I don't know. I agree. Attention. You agree with uh, Kelly Clarkson? I'll agree with Kelly Clarkson. She's good, been on the show quite a good bit. Good thing you did. It was called Pop Idol. Pop Idol, not... Well, she did, she did the wrong thing. She agreed with Rock and Roll right. Idol. Oh, I no, agree. No, he said false. She got it right. She is absolutely right. I agree right. that he said false. Oh. I said false. I'm totally confused with Please let here. me moderate. <laughs> All right. We've got two X's on the board and one O and Joey Buttafuoco. It's a game of strategy. So go ahead and pick someone. I think we'll pick Melrose. Melrose, Larry Green for the block. 
How are you, Melrose? It's great to be back, Howard. Uh, to purchase Melrose Larry's book, Why the Clintons Belong in Prison, go to MelroseLarry.com. I've got a book right here, Howard. I've got one for you. True or false, Melrose Larry was close friends with Sam Kinison. True or true false? Or false. False. That's true. Melrose became friendly with Sam in 1976 when he moved to Houston. Believe it or not, they actually were friends. You didn't How? even let Melrose answer yeah, yeah, the question. Like Howard, Howard. Oh, I'm sorry. Howard, <laughs> Howard, Howard. Thanks, you know, Howard. Howard, Howard. Yes. I got regards to you from Uncle Frank, from Jimmy Kimmel, and the Tokens. All right. I, now I know why I banned you for two years. <laughs> you know why you didn't talk to me. Nicole. I could have won. Well, and you, you just you, ruined it. Well, no, actually, uh, you, he got it wrong, so you have an opportunity to win right now. Okay. Go ahead. Melrose Larry Green. For the win. For the win. All right. <laughs> Melrose, you're a traitor. That's why you were banned from the show. So let's ask you some uh, traitor questions. <laughs> Melrose. Yes. Sir. Julius and Ethel Rosenberg, two traitors just like you, <laughs> were executed for giving atomic secrets to the Soviet Union. Were they given lethal injection or were they electrocuted? That one I know. They were definitely electrocuted. And what do you say, Nicole? Agree or disagree? I'll agree. And you're right and you win $2,500. Wow. Yes. Wow. Wow. We didn't get to use all of the squares, unfortunately. I know. Hey, do we have any extra money? Maybe we could go to some of the other squares and see if Joey can't pick up some money. Yeah. I can yeah. Sure use it. Do we I have could, any? Uh, I got it. Uh, I'm going to go to a limb here. I, think, I believe I have $1,000 courtesy of Bally Total Fitness. Is that right? $1,000 from Bally? Want to play another round, guys? Let, let, let me just check that with Tom. You got it. Yeah, go got ahead. It. Tom will put the money Tom's in. a man. Let's play another game. Let's play cool. another round of Hollywood cool. Squares. I mean, we got the Spit Girls. Let's use them. Yeah, we hardly got to the Spit Girls. We didn't even hear from Trick Daddy. No. Wendy the retard's asleep in her square. <laughs> Is she? Wendy, are you sleeping? No, I'm just uh, looking at the floor. Uh huh. Okay. Trick Daddy, you're not sleeping, are you? Uh, no way. Yeah, we love your new album, by the way. Uh, Married to the Streets, featuring the single Let's Go. Very, very strong, very strong music. Daniel Carver, wide awake, ready to talk about anything racial. How's your personal life, Daniel? The family all right? Yeah, we're doing real fine, Howard. We were down in Daytona last week for Bike Week and had a great time. Seems like he's always on vacation when he does. Yeah. Oh, well, I'm, I'm old enough to take a lot of vacation. My wife's retired. And, and All right. You, you gave me a little extra money last year, so we're enjoying ourselves. Oh, you won it. Yes, Bob Abu. That's the thousand dollars. Oh, you now. made it so easy for me. Hey guys, we got a thousand dollars courtesy of Seed of Chucky. Oh. Oh man. Seed of Chucky. Yeah. Last time he took a bride. This time he's passing his seed to the next generation. Chucky has a baby in this one. So thank you for that. A thousand dollars. Just like the call. When does it open? <laughs> Jelly's baby. God forbid. Jesus. You feel Chucky's baby is going to look just like Nicole Bass? It does. It does? You saw, saw it? You saw, saw it. 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 <laughs> figures. Yes, yes Wendy. Be like first um, online my to go friend, see a movie like that. My friend Jody and Scott and Mel from O Rock 159, they want me to tell you that they said hi and they love your great show. And, oh. and they are number raised because of you. Thank you. Stop You're welcome. interrupting. Sorry. <laughs> I think Jeff the drunk fell asleep. Let's see. I don't sleep, bitch. I'm not asleep. Yeah, don't fall asleep with a cigarette in your hand. <laughs> Elephant boy, you're awake? Yeah, I'm awake. All right, Colin, you're really glad you came here today? Yes, I am. All right, good. Yeah. <laughs> Jeff, Squ Jeff Square looks like backstage at an Almond Brothers concert. <laughs> yeah, Jeff, you moved right into that square. It's bigger than your house. Look at that. I mean, What's it say on your shirt? I am a pimp? <laughs> I thought it said I am a pump. I'm a pimp. <laughs> All right. Hi, Hi, Kelly. <laughs> I can't believe Trick Daddy hasn't moved his way into the Spit Girls uh, square. <laughs> Trick Daddy, I thought for sure you'd be making out with them. I, hey, I was wondering, could we do that on this show? You can do whatever you want. You're do Trick Daddy. Yeah. That's right, baby. Yeah, but Daniel will go nuts because he doesn't want to see black guys with any <laughs> white women, right? You don't, you're against that for sure. I, it's sickening. <laughs> <laughs> What about I, what they do for a living, Daniel? They're spit girls. Wow. But, hey, but ask him, hey, how you got to ask him how come his son is also his grandson. My son and grandson have both the same name. They're Daniel Carver Jr. and Daniel Carver They got Carver the same III. mama, too. Is it Daniel? No, nigger, they, ain't, they ain't got the same mama. There's a Daniel Carver Jr. and Daniel and Carver III. III. Right. It's like George Foreman. Yeah, that's a legacy. They couldn't remember her names. <laughs> 
I, because he's inbred. Hey, trick so daddy. Bad. Yeah. If Daniel ever went down to your hood and said the N word, he wouldn't even live for a minute, right? No, I violate I, probation. I try to stay away from niggers all I can, Howard. I, I'll vote him. <laughs> all right. How well. is he still alive? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Because, because, he, because he ain't been to Miami yet. He come to Miami. They don't have to worry about it. I ain't lost though. nothing in Miami. <laughs> Yo, Trick Daddy, I love Daniel Carvin. What's up? Trick Daddy, what's up? Daniel Carvin, you my man. I love Mel you. Melrose. 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 You're, 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 da- you're dangerously close to being banned again. Yeah. <laughs> Mel Rose. Sure, Larry. I mean, no. Daniel Carvin doesn't love you. Hey, Daniel, Mel Rose. I, Daniel. Do, what's up, Trick Daddy? Do you got a knife or something, a blade or something on you? <laughs> Look out. Why don't you go in and cut yourself, kill yourself, man. Save me some time. All right, let's you get to the game. You like an egger now, ain't you? <laughs> Always want a knife. Jesus. Knife. Trick. Ball bat. Anything. Trick Daddy, I just want to say that I can't hold away to get your new album. I I got I got a couple of your albums, and you're the biggest. You're one of my biggest fans. Uh, and you're one of my biggest fans. <laughs> I love that song, I'm a Thug, and... And take it to the house. Sing a little, baby. Sing it, sing it, Wendy. (laughs) One play, take it to the house. Uh. (laughs) She didn't practice. (laughs) (laughs) All right, it's time for the squares. Let's get back to the game. All right, Joey, we'll let you go first this time. Let's see how you do. Um. Who are you gonna pick? Let's get a little entertaining with the Spit Girls. The Spit Girls, you like them, right? No, not really. Someone said you're getting married. Uh, maybe. Yeah, you got a girlfriend and everything. Yeah, great All right. girl. Spit great girl. Girls, you've been in so many different movies, and we can check you out at meatholes.com. <laughs> Spit Wars. Yes, Howard. True or false? In a lifetime, the average man will produce seven quarts of man juice. Seven, seven quarts, quarts in his lifetime. <laughs> What do you think? I think it's more. <laughs> I just swallowed more this week. I, know. I think Daniel Carver just let out seven quarts looking at you. Yeah. Um, I, seven quarts, it's actually, it's like a teaspoon, isn't it? Normal true thing. or false? Yeah. Oh, I, I say true. true. You say that's true. 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 Seven. And in his whole lifetime, the average man will produce seven quarts of man juice. Joey? Agree disagree. or disagree? Sorry. I disagree. You disagree. That's good. A man will ejaculate approximately 18 quarts oh, of semen oh, containing oh, half see, a trillion sperm. Oh, you 18 quarts of man juice. How many did you do, Nicole? (laughs) Joey. I haven't started with him. I've been good. Right. Okay. I want to keep Gary as my friend. All right. And this guy, this loser over here, fresh out of prison. Out of prison. Right. All right. Mr. I have a CD. Let's get down to the game, Nicole. Time for you to pick the spit girl. You've got Kelly Clarkson. How you're innocent. You got Trick Daddy. Of everything. I never met anybody innocent of so many things. <laughs> <laughs> I'm innocent. I think we should play the game. All right, let's go to Nicole Bess. Nicole, you were insulted by Joey. He asked how many quarts of man juice you released in a lifetime, <laughs> and that set off this latest fight. But now it's time to pick a square. Right. Poor Bob. Bob? Her husband. Oh. Yeah. Go ahead. Poor Joey. I would love... Howard, you don't know how much respect I have for you because, they, honestly, I would punch the living hell out of him right All now. All right, let's get down I, to You the couldn't run down way. to the end of the block. You want to have a running race and that'll, that'll settle it? You couldn't make it I would the run block. Easy. You'd never do it. You'd fall down. I, I run five miles a day, dear uh, heart. Where? The fridge? <laughs> <laughs> you ain't running. You want to run? Let's run I'll around run. the block. We'll run I'll a city run. block. If I'll the run. E-guys can keep up with... Well, they'll keep up with you. They ain't keeping up with me. You Babe. will fall right, down. We'll I'll put a thousand dollars on it. I will have a race After later. The game. <laughs> yeah, thousand dollars. You can't run around the block. You couldn't run around the block. Right, You're five too grand. busy sitting on your butt five grand in the, in the I Nicole, pick a square. Yard. Pick a square. square. I have a yeah. little money on me. Um, five grand. I'll put that let's down. Let's get to the square. I like. I think Colin Quinn is really Colin. funny. Uh-oh. Let's go to Colin. And he's yes. been canceled for the week. Somebody should hire him. So thanks, Nicole. Colin Quinn. <laughs> ColinQuinn.com. All right. Thanks, Nicole. <laughs> Colin, you uh, told us on the air you had a gay experience. So let me ask you this: true or false? <laughs> He gets a great question. According to You're you, making me the gate. <laughs> <laughs> the gatekeeper, man. Aren't you glad you came? According to I you, I actually am. This is kind of a thrill. According to U.S. Health and Human Services, ninety <laughs> percent of Americans are walking around with clogged colons. Ninety percent of Americans are walking around with clogged colons. Wow. True or false? 
Uh, I, 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 did, I mean, that's... Have why you tested that, that many colons? <laughs> why How many colons have you... <laughs> yeah, I don't like the idea that you... I know you don't. It doesn't I knew matter. You what do I care? Um, I'm going to say true. True or false? A lot of people are stopped up out there, and they can't go, so I'm going to have to agree. And you agreed properly. True. It came wow. out several years ago that over 90% of Americans are walking around with clogged colons. That's terrible. Colin. Hello, Colin. It's a, hi, uh, Eric. Can, can, you, mean, can, you see, can you see if I have clogged colons? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a yes. Maybe that's Daniel's problem. <laughs> Daniel, do you know if you have a clogged colon? <laughs> no, I don't think I do have one. Right. You eat well. You have uh, all the right foods. Yeah, I try to eat right. All right. Let's go to Joey Buttafuoco. Joey, uh, let's see. It's, uh, well, it's tied. It's, there's one O and there's one X, and it's your turn. Let's go for uh, Kelly Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson. A moment Hi, like Joey. this. Joey. All right. Hi, Nicole. I mean, Kelly. Who's the call? It's Kelly This Clark. monster sitting next to me. <laughs> You oh, gotta start. Nicole you gotta very beautiful. Start. Thank you. You look really beautiful too, oh, Kelly. Man. Thank you, sweetie. Oh, man. your makeup came out fabulous. Thank you. All right, rest um, my case, Howard. All right, true or false? The slang term used when your testicle sack sticks to your thighs in hot weather is called chicken wings. True or false? Ooh, I'm Kelly Clarkson, so I would have to say, uh, true. What do you think, Joey? Is that true? It's a guess, but I'll, I'll agree with him. It's false. It's bat oh, wings. Yeah, bat, bat wings. I was gonna say bubble gum because it looks like a bat. What do you say, Nicole? <laughs> what do yours do? <laughs> I don't have any. Well, we're gonna have to put a uh, X up there, I guess. Uh, yes. Yeah. X marks the spot. All right, there you go. Let's go to uh, Nicole Bass. I want to keep the game going, go but ahead. I don't want him to win the thousand. So. Mm. What to do, what to do. I could pick Jeff the Drunk, but look, you got Trick Daddy up I like there. your attitude. Yeah, go to Trick Daddy. I'm Come on. I'm going to go to Trick Daddy. All right, Trick Daddy. Because you know what? Nicole's a good guy. He wants to make sure that we uh, keep the game going. I okay. respect that. Want to go kick Howard's ass now? <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. No. Trick so Daddy's I. new album, Thugs Matrimony. Married to the Street featuring the single Let's Go available stores now. Okay. Trick. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready. What sort of gun did police find in Puff Daddy's Lincoln Navigator after a nightclub shooting in December 1999? He said it wasn't his. He blamed it on Shine. Do you remember what kind of gun it was? <laughs> it was um, an AK-47. An AK-47. <laughs> Nicole, is that true or false? I'll say Trick, it's Trick Daddy. He's like really tied in with these people. He's got to know. Going to say true. Oh. Well, it's false. It's oh. a nine millimeter. Oh. Puffy oh. always has his nine millimeter. Oh. Ask the redneck what's the difference between an AK and a nine millimeter. <laughs> Daniel, what's the difference an between... AK is an assault rifle. Do not go to trickdaddy.com. Wait a second, Trick Daddy. Wait, wait, what did you say, Daniel? I said an AK is an assault rifle. A nine millimeter would be a pistol. There you go, Trick. Nah, he's wrong, too. Oh, you stupid nigger. Oh, you got some ball bed or a pocket knife. The 9 millimeters for me to give you with no clipping well, and the AK okay. for me to hit you in your back of your head with it. <laughs> you hit me in the back. Uh, I love you two guys together. I smell sitcom. I think they should go on tour. <laughs> yes. All right. Well, you didn't get that one right, Nicole. So Trick Daddy and Spit Girls, and let's see I'm adding up all the O's and X's. It's 2 to 2 right now. All right, let's go where over to... Where are you going, to, Joey? Joey, where are you going to go? Oh, man, oh, man. It's a tough one. Let's go with Melrose Larry Green again. Melrose! I always like Melrose. His I new like book, you, Joey. Wrong His new you. book, Why the Clintons Belong in Prison, go to MelroseLarry.com. Who's buying that? Do you know it's ranked uh, number 1,658,293 uh, on uh, Amazon.com? Oh, <laughs> congratulations. How do you remember that? Melrose, you're a traitor, so let's... Uh, Howard, Howard... After I, Benedict Arnold was a traitor to his country, what country did he live in exile? <laughs> you're oh, a traitor. You should know this. Well, first of all, Howard... <laughs> It's great to be back. I after would Benedict say, Arnold. Yes, yes, after, after what he got, country? He, what country did he go to to live in he exile? Was exiled to Portugal. He says Portugal. Agree or disagree? I'm going to disagree. Smart man. England. Of course. Oh. All right, Melrose. Howard. I can't believe you got me back here. I'm You're glad. a traitor. I'm not a traitor. I love yeah, you, Howard. Yeah, it was hard to get you back, Larry. I love you, Baba Booey. <laughs> All right, it's Artie time rules. to go to Artie Nicole rules. Bass. Okay. Wendy, 
keep your clothes on, but I'm going to pick you. Wendy the retard. Wake up, Wendy. Okay, Robin. <laughs> Time for you to wake up and answer this question. Here we go. Nicole Bass believes in you. Are you ready? Yes. Wendy, who's smarter, an idiot or a moron? <laughs> who's smarter? A moron. Wendy says a moron is, is smarter. smarter. <laughs> Great question. <laughs> an idiot is smarter. So you disagree? I disagree. Should have agreed. An idiot has oh. an IQ of below 20. A moron has an IQ of 50 to 69. Oh, the moron is smarter. Wendy's moron. right. Wendy I'm knows her morons. No, you're not. Circle <laughs> Wendy. Moron. Nice job, Wendy. Thank circle you, gets the square. That's right, no, circle. You care for the win. Oh, oh that's, that's right. right. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> now I who's a moron? That. Me and Robin. I quit wasn't looking at the board. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Joey, it's time for you. Step up. Maybe you'll keep the game going like uh, Nicole did. Maybe yeah. you'll be a brave man. I can do that. Yeah. Or I can do the cheap thing and go for the grand. That's there true. You go. I mean, that is you true. Gotta think about what's best for you. A real man who was into comedy would go to Daniel Carver, but a man who wanted to win a thousand dollars would go to Wendy. I honestly can't believe he's still alive, man. Who, Daniel? Yeah. Come on. It's strange. Can we all just get along? I think he's gonna live forever. Yeah, no, I don't think so. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Daniel's my center square. <laughs> Um, He's Daniel. Up Poland. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky us. Daniel. I'll live till God gets ready to take me, and nigger daddy won't have nothing to do with it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. uh, we'll go for Wendy. Let's try that. Trick Daddy, when your neighborhood where you grew up, a man's life could be taken for for, for five thousand dollars. Isn't that right? Uh, Wendy, stop drinking into the <laughs> microphone. <laughs> Isn't that right, Trick Daddy? Daddy. Well, can you repeat that? Um, five thousand. That's a lot of money. I mean, right. You kill his whole family, kill all the red mix. <laughs> wow. All right. Well, there you go. All What's right. the question? Where are we going? To Wendy the retard? Wendy, yeah. All right. You want the $1,000, oh, I I'll see. try. All right. Here we go. Wendy, are there more female retards or male retards? Uh, male. You say there are more male retards. Hmm. All right. Joey? You think she'd know, right? I don't think she knows what day it is. <laughs> Wendy says there are more male, male. retards. Agree I think as a chick would say that, huh? Mm -hmm. More male retards. Jeez, I don't know, man. You're not buying a condo. Don't look at me. It's just another one. Yeah, that's a perfect example. I'm going to agree with Wendy. You say there are more male retards? Well, I'm going to agree with her. Well, you did it again, Wendy. You're right. Female retards, 40%. There you go, 60% male retards. You've won $1,000, Joey. And you should thank Nicole because she was good enough to keep oh, the game cool. going. Oh, I thought Nicole won that. Seriously. No, Actually, you win. You did. Oh, cool. You actually won that because of Nicole. She, Thanks, she, Nick. She kept going. You're she welcome, did. Josephine. <laughs> I got to thank Thank this great panel of Holly Weird Squares. Uh, Kelly Clarkson, thank you. Trick Daddy, where are we going to see you? You going on tour anywhere? Uh, yeah, I'm going to be in the redneck backyard looking for him. So y'all check me out. I'm going to be looking for him in his backyard. Go get Daniel Carver. Huh? You're going to be peering in Daniel Carver's backyard. Yeah. And they call us violent. Y'all watch out for them joint chiefs. Me, Twister, T.I., Fabulous, and Fat Joe. Coming soon to you. And we'll look for your uh, record in stores right now, Trick That's Daddy. Right. Third match you want to go cop then. Spit Girls, what goes on at meatholes.com? Can we see you out there? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I, I love your, your... Let me play something from your latest film. This is Cammy uh, appearing in one of her films, and everyone should hear this. And tell us what you are. I'm a messy little spit covered, dirty pig. It's true. Isn't that nice? The, <laughs> that's hey, great. Was, yes. What was the last time they spoke to their parents? <laughs> Did you guys ever speak to your parents or have they just killed themselves? <laughs> oh, of course my mommy's Aww. proud of me. They asked me that when I was on meat calls, and I was a good girl and I did what I was told. So your father and mother don't mind that you do this kind of work? No. Uh, well, mine do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When's the last time you spoke to your mom? 
about four weeks ago. Oh, really? And yeah. she doesn't like what you do? What about your dad? Did he uh, kill himself? Oh, God. <laughs> My dad's a minister. Oh, You're boy. kidding me. <laughs> yeah, always. no, I'm not. There you always. go. Sweet. It's always no. a minister. Always. Yeah, Why do I, so I, many... I don't talk to him. Why do so many ministers' daughters become um, um, porn, porn star. stars? Come on. <laughs> Rebellion. Oh. A little bit of rebellion, a little bit of, I don't know, I just, I do it because I like it. All right, NikkiHunter.com and also mm-hmm. uh, CamiAndrews.com and MeatHoles.com. It's Meat actually CamiLand. I Cammy appreciate Land. the plug, but that's not really the site. It's CamiLand. CamiLand.com. All right. Thank you. Colin Quinn, what show will you be canceled from next? Um, uh, I'll, be, I'll be appearing through this week on my show, then that's finished. Oh, right. Colin, As I'm sorry. On. Thanks, Kelly. Did and I I'll, get a plug? I get a plug, right? Did I say you will. my stupid minute, website? Shut up. ColinQuinn.com. ColinQuinn.com. Oh, yeah. Colin, you, uh, you were on Comedy Central. The show was very funny. The public didn't understand that I guess. Thanks. Well, we didn't get any reviews from the media for a year and a half, so that <laughs> tells you something about well, I believe your next show will be great. I certainly hope I hit it out of the park. Thanks. <laughs> Daniel, I guess you're uh, offering Christmas gifts uh, to, for people to buy for the Christmas season. Do they have to order early? Yeah, they need la, to go la, in. La, la, they la, got la, a, la, la, la. Well, they got a club. catalog. They need to go He's, in and order them. What kind of racist gifts are you selling? I have clan belt buckles, clan T-shirts, oh. stickers, rings, I heard the CDs. Clan, I got those Daniel, Johnny Rebel CDs, all them nigger-hating songs. I heard the clan is now actually done. Dying off, that there are less and less they're, members. They're going more underground be- because of the, they're afraid. Because uh, I'm putting them they're underground. Afraid. No, you ain't going <laughs> underground because I'm putting they're, them underground. They're, they're, they're losing their year. jobs. Uh, they're they ain't got to worry sued. about you. <laughs> and uh, they don't want to be sued. They don't want to lose a job. So they're, they're going underground. Well, Trick Daddy says he's driven you underground. No, Trick Daddy ain't done nothing except kill his own kind. I'm going to put you underground. Well, well okay. Put me there then. <laughs> I'm going to take that thing on your head and choke you with it after the show. <laughs> Anything new in the catalog this that. year? I believe that. You're right with you, Daniel, are there any new items? Uh, no, it's the same items. I have a few uh, new bumper stickers. I have a, a new bumper sticker here in my pocket. Uh, What's that? Did you, yes. Listen right here. It says the only thing lower than a nigger is an ignorant white whores that associate with them. Mm. Boy, that's some catchy Wait a minute. Oh, Wait a minute. No, 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 girls, no, no, no. Spit girls. They have bigger penises. Spit girls, you you have make love to black men, don't you? Absolutely. Yes, I do. They know well, how to treat an ass. Then you're lower than a nigger. Oh, oh, baby, we're right on top of you. You're lower than a nigger. <laughs> and the bumper stickers, what? The, the people put those on their cars? You, wouldn't you be afraid to drive around with that on your car? No, you don't put them on your car. Put them on a nigger's car. <laughs> 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 oh, I see. You buy that to put it on someone. Yeah. Elephant Boy seems to yeah, like let this. Him, let them have some reverse <laughs> discrimination. Nice cars in your neighborhood to know. Which Show them what reverse which. discrimination is. Stick one of them on the nigger's bumper and see what happens to his car. Will there ever be peace in this world? I wonder. Not, not as long. You them. can't have law and order in niggers too. Not if he. Bo- not if he planning on voting for George Bush. I'm voting for Bush. Who said Larry. that? Larry. Larry Melrose. Larry is a Bush supporter. Big. Wendy the retard. Thank you, oh, Daniel. Thank you, and Wendy the retard. Thank you. There's no plug for you, is there? How um, I just want to ask you, can I come in there and take a couple pictures of you? Because I want to show you my new outfit that I wore today just for you. It is hot. Do I have to? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, my website is going to be up really soon. It's going to be www.rayandwendy.com. And my friend over at Daytona Beach, Frank Scott's putting it together for me. And I'm going to have a chat room in there. And people can chat with me. <laughs> and also, I'm going to have video games and a clip wow. of me on there. Look at you that. You can listen to. Wow. I'm going to make it one of my links. <laughs> and there are going to be pictures of my fans on there. And Howard's going to be on my website, All right. Too. Thank you, Wendy. Hello, Howard. It's okay. Kelly. Uh, my retard has a chat room. Uh, <laughs> let's go to Jeff Caro. Thank him. How long does it take to move into a trailer? He still hasn't gotten there yet. I know. It's like eventually, maybe. <laughs> we didn't even get to ask Elephant Boy or Jeff Caro a question. Yeah. I had so many heavy drinking questions for Jeff Caro. Stuff happened. Oh, I didn't realize I, he never I have fun. Ask me one anyway. All right. <laughs> How many drinks in a row is considered to be binge drinking for a man? How many drinks? In a row? Yeah. I say <laughs> seven. It's five drinks in a row for men, four drinks in a row for women. Oh. Can drinking make you mental? Never. Yes. <laughs> Heavy drinking can make you mental. There's no proof of that. <laughs> There's no yeah. proof of drinking Alan, makes I'm you mental. I'm from the smell of his beer. <laughs> All right, elephant boy. Yeah. Said hey, well. Howard. And Melrose, congratulations. Howard. To you. Yes. How Can I, I wanna... sit in for the news? How no. I've had enough you of you. A question. Yes, Wendy. You're getting out um, of hand now. 
Um, are you, uh, I heard that you were going to try and get me and my mom a cell, uh, a serious, I mean, a serious radio. Yes, I'm going to get it for you, yes. When, right. Wendy, Wendy, let Howard do my plug. It's Melrose. It's Melrose. <laughs> my retard needs a radio. MelroseLarry.com. You can get his book, Why the Clintons Belong in Prison. This is Kelly Clarkson. Uh, George Bush. All right. I want to thank Joey Buttafuoco. Joey, you got a plug? Uh, TheRealJoey.com. It's got some neat stuff on Hi, there. Hi, Pitcherick. I have a question uh, to hey, ask Wendy. you. Hey, Wendy. You're yes, stepping Wendy. on my time here. Uh, <laughs> Joey, you it's MelroseLarry.com. You need to stop being, no Larry. You need to stop being gay, high picture, and you need to quit dress up as a woman. <laughs> MelroseLarry.com. Actually, looks pretty good. Because you embarrassed me and my mom today. All <laughs> right. Thank you. Uh, Joey, yes, you said your website? The real, the real Joey.com it has a lot of interesting stuff. Like what? So. <laughs> like what? No, no, I'm curious. Like what's on there? Stuff, a lot of clothing and, oh, okay. oh. and uh, stuff like that. Can I sue it for the news? I had all this great stuff from my place down in Mexico, and the Who Mexicans robbed it all. I got it back, so I'm selling it, you know. Oh. It robbed my eyes. The white's right out of my eyes. All right. But so, you know, stuff like that. The and Nicole Bass, com. what about you? You have a plug? I have uh, NicoleBass.com. Also, I do phone sessions now. Phone sessions? So, so you can call and and you talk about I pretty much talk about anything. Are you Someone talk- told me that for three dollars a minute you will have phone sex with them. Yep. What do you think of that? Go ahead, Joey. What do you think of that, man? <laughs> you know what? I, I just want to throw up right now. <laughs> Trick Daddy, can I have your autograph? I bet it would be good. <laughs> Trick Daddy, can Wendy get your autograph? Yeah, baby, you, you get really? anything you want. Oh, that's sweet. Okay, that's nice. And listen, oh, to- by the way, Howard, uh oh, question ask you for your. Project Y. Sure. I can't say it, but you know what I mean. I Very never know new, what you mean. You new business adventure. Howard. Yes. How was I? Horrible. Yes, yes you were terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Bye, Bye. 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 All right, goodbye, squares. So long, everybody. Thanks to all the squares. We appreciate it. And I love you, Colin. <laughs> and Joey and Nicole, I this is the way to it. settle your fights right here on the Hollywood Square. There you go. All right, we'll be back there right after go. these words. Not bad. Not bad. Joey and I didn't kill each other. I was actually pretty nice, and I gave him the other. I got 2500 and then it was like we only used three squares, so I was like, hey, we got to keep the game going. So they put up another 1000 and we played some more Hollywood squares. How do you Hollywood play? squares. I played pretty good. Yeah? Yeah. Did you have a good time today? I had a great time. Great Thanks time. Down, Nicole. Thank you. Well, Joe, how do you think everything went? I think it was a great game. It was a great show. Great game. We had a lot of fun, man. Yeah, how do you think you played? Um, fair. I think I played all right. It was fun. This is better than the other, than the real Hollywood squares, man. What did you think of Nicole winning the first batch there? Uh, you know what? Good for her. Uh, honestly, good for her. I'm glad she won it. So you guys settled your bad blood? Hey, I didn't get my money. All right, we'll work that out for you. Okay, it's all good. No, I'm decent. You know what, man? It's like, she wants to fight. I, w- I would fight her in a heartbeat. What do you think? You know. Do you want? But I, I swear to God, I don't think she could make it to the end of the block. And I, I'll put five grand up if she could. I swear to God, I really would. I don't think she could make it around the block. If she did, I'd give it a five grand. How was Hollywood Squares? Hollywood Squares. Hollywood whatever, weirds, whatever. But uh, for that redneck, don't let me catch you in Dade County, boy. You're going to be my slave. You heard me? I know. <laughs> Maybe we'll all be on the same website. You never know. <laughs> Look at these two. What's going on here? Oh. Come on, we'll link. We'll have links. Okay. I'll Is link it you guys' you. website? I'll we can link. You. We can personally link. Oh, All right. <laughs> Colin, what the hell's can going we... on here? I don't know. <laughs> They're fans of Tough Crowd. I'm so, I'm so, so happy. That's so nice. Oh, they really are. Like that? I do. I do. I'm actually getting a little. Uh-huh. It's great. Really? Oh, we'll be the judge. I am huh? starting to get slightly. <laughs> 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 this is nice. Thank oh, God. I gotta get my camera. Colin, you too. Colin, this pictures. is what we call parting gifts. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Where do you guys live? In Manhattan, New York? Uh, I'm in L.A. Yes, I'm in. Oh, L.A. Mm-hmm. You come out of L.A. Yes. Yes. I do come out, yes. There we go. There we go. Everybody pose. Everybody pose. Man, I discovered these whores, man. I should get... Can I Can I get the... Can I, can I just put it in your face, please? Oh, all right, yeah. Do you want to spit in my mouth? Yeah. Yeah? I go no, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I love it. Wait, where's the camera? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> my, 
One more, one more. One more, one more. No, 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 no. no, no, no. Please, 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 please. I feel so good. Really fresh I I got my favorite thing was, hey, I'm getting kind of excited. I want Colin to spit on me. Hold on, Nick, what do you want? I want Colin to spit on me. Wait, don't. I want Colin, I want Colin Quinn to spit on me. Then I'll just be like everybody else. Y'all can have normal vag sex. Colin, can I spit on your face? What's that? Can I spit on your face, please? Are you nuts? Come on, please, let me spin in your I face, please. Come on, for me. I got you these girls. Let me spin in your face, dude. You can spin in my face, but you know the response is going to be. Uh-oh. A smackdown. Oh. Yeah. Colin, hey, come here. Look at the face. I was kissing you in the side of the face like that. Yo, Look, Jesus Christ Look. almighty. Give me a kiss. <laughs> what happened to your face? I got kissed by, Ke I got kissed by Kelly. He's my new friend. Hey, look up, look up, look up, look up at me. Hi. Oh, that's great. That's just classic. Okay, thank you, sweetheart. Thank you. You know what you are? You're a dirty fucking spit girl. Oh, ouch. Oh, yeah. Right there. Ready? Ready? Yes, yes, yes. Really Break oh, it over my head. Hit me over the head with that crack. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, no. Yeah. I respect it. One more, one more, one more. Okay. Okay, one more, one more. Hey, Jeff. Oh, oh. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta, I got red marks now. You gotta get Jeff Actually, on it. Can you do it to if you if you, you okay? don't want to stay, yeah. You have to. We're recording some problems, but I don't. But if you want to stay, oh, oh my goodness! You, fucking <laughs> <wise ass. laughs> you know, the one day I'm not gonna fucking rush out. Okay, look, you do you say you oh boy, you oh boy, is yeah. that going sure. in somewhere? What? What? Well, what's he doing now? He's gonna get spanked. Oh my god! I'm a fat pig. Right him! Right him! What are you? 